James Kaufman, World News Report today. Very rare triple superior conjunction is underway. This could mean an uptick in solar activity, volcanic activity here on Earth, and even earthquake activity here on Earth. We just had a simultaneous superior conjunction last week, which occurs at the most every six years. Well, Noah says now we have just started a triple superior conjunction, which I will show you on a map in just one moment. Noah believes that this planetary alignment of Jupiter, our Moon, Earth, Mercury, Venus, and Mars should cause increased solar activity, and that it may trickle down to a strong effect here on Earth in the form of volcanoes and earthquakes, as the simultaneous conjunction appeared to do. Most of the solar activity during the first simultaneous superior rare conjunction luckily happened on the far side of our star facing the aligning planets. But we will have to wait to see what happens this time around. This is even more of a rare event, although they haven't given us, well, a time period, i.e. how often it occurs. Again, this is a quote-unquote very rare conjunction of three planets, and it is underway already. Don't try to look, though. It's happening around the sun, and this could be dangerous. The Soho chronograph image that we just saw shows Venus, Mars, and Mercury clustered around the solar disk on January 12th, although the conjunction will occur on January 19th through January 29th per NOAA. Now, I have the planetstoday.com here on the 18th, and we can see this line up. This is the 18th, and we will go into the 19th, but this really looks like when it starts here. They say it starts on the 19th. That sun comes around perfectly. I like it just as much on the 18th. And they say that it goes through the 29th. So we will go there and see what the 29th looks like. And to me, that's not the lineup we're looking for. But they say that that will cause, well, some magnetic or geomagnetic activity. Now you can see here that Earth has a geomagnetic connection to Jupiter and Uranus at this point in time, the 29th. And on the 18th, uh, likewise. And I believe that this looks like it starts on the 18th, not the 19th, as they have indicated. Again, astronomers call this a triple superior solar conjunction. It's superior because all three planets, Mars, Venus, and Mercury, are on the far side or opposite side of the sun as seen from Earth. This event resets the visibility of the three planets. When the conjunction breaks up later this month, Venus and Mercury will become evening stars, shining in the end-of-day twilight, while Mars shifts to the dawn as a red morning planet. Two dates of special significance, January 18th, and that's what I thought, when Mars is less than one degree from Mercury, and January 29th, when Venus and Mercury are only two-thirds of one degree apart. These many conjunctions won't be easy to see because of the glare of the sun, but could cause big problems here on Earth and on the other aligned planets. Based on what we see on theplanetstoday.com and the alignments themselves, they suggest that the 17th, 18th, and 19th could be some of the worst days of this triple superior alignment, but time will tell. Stay tuned. As you know, I'll be watching for any unusual action during this time period. Please give us a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you haven't, and always remember that anything's possible in Bizarro World.